Hi, I'm Jim Stout from Roland and at 2020 NAM show, and we are showing the very first MIDI 2.0 compatible controller. So this is brand new. It's a new protocol. Um, higher resolution, up to 256 MIDI channels, 32-bit. Uh, it also has what's called package delivery, where it will absolutely recognize what instrument is coming in and help map control so there's going to be tighter integration to the software. So that's one thing we're showing right here. The other cool thing about MIDI 2.0 is it's also backwards compatible with MIDI 1.0. So that's very, very handy so it's not going to disrupt any of your setups. The other thing that we're showing is the Roland Cloud Suite, which is a collection of over 50 instruments of classic Roland instruments. So we have the Jupiter 8, the Juno 106, the TB303, SH101, so on and so on. We also have the um, the legendary XV5080, so a lot of uh, film guys used these a lot back in, in the day when they came out. So now all this stuff is available in software for you. We also have all the SRX expansion boards that are their own plugins now. And then we still have our classic analog model. Um, and these are component level modeled instruments. So they are very, very detailed and they behave exactly like a uh, Jupiter 8 would. And so one of the other cool things about this stuff, we actually have condition knobs on here, so you can actually age the instrument. So if you want to make it sound like a brand new out of the box Jupiter 8, you can make it sound like that, or you can make it sound like one that's 30 years old and seen a little too much road time. So those are, those are the, uh, the instruments in Rolling Cloud. So go to rollingcloud.com to check out, check out that stuff. And then we're also showing Zen Beats, which is our production app, which is all cross uh, platform compatible. So you can do um, iOS, uh, Android, PC, and Macintosh. And you can switch between files. And so you can create stuff on your phone and then transfer that to your desktop app and finish up your production. So those are the three main things we're showing off uh, here at the press event. Can you tell me just a little bit about the 88 uh, MK2? Because I can tell the feel of it. It's yes. It's great weighted keys. This is the latest progressive action. So basically, this is actually very much like a piano. So when you think of a real piano, in the lower register, you've got heavier hammers that hit the strings. So this is what's called a graduated keyboard. So as you go up the keyboard, the keys have a lighter touch to them, just like a real piano. Over here, you've got eight real-time controls that you can assign. You've got pads that you can assign, so we can make these note triggers, or we can actually do program changes with it. All these knobs are assignable. You can split and layer the keyboard, octave shifts, and you also have these two S controls where you can assign additional controls to it if you want. So basically, if you wanted to you know, make this a filter or make something different, you can change these in real time and modulate them uh, however you see fit. You've got bank shots, you have snapshots, and it also has the, uh, the uh, MIDI 1.0 spec built in into it as well. So you can use your standard MIDI or, you, or MIDI 2.0. And then one more question, does it have an expression pedal input in the back? Yes, it does. Sustain and expression, all the fun stuff. All the connections are here on the back. Excellent. Yes. Uh, thank you so much for your time, Jim. Oh, my pleasure.